wow, that tastes um kind of mediocre, but I mean, what was I expecting? It's just coffee and milk. All right, anyway, good morning, hello. My name is Neka. I am a 28-year-old graduate student studying clinical psychology at Columbia University Teachers College. I'm also an intern at the UNFPA, also a part-time yoga teacher at Core Power, and you know, I'm probably forgetting a million other things that I also do. I'm also a YouTuber, so good morning, welcome to my channel. I currently have 816 subscribers and my goal was to get to a thousand by my birthday, which is actually next week, so not sure if that's going to happen, but maybe we can get to a thousand by the end of the year. So if you'd subscribe, that would really make my day and hopefully you can be subscriber number 817. I don't know if I'm going to start this vlog today. I did vlog a bit on Monday and I think with like starting the UN internship and then like also having school and also having midterms, I just got like really overwhelmed trying to vlog everything. So I definitely put down the vlogging camera on Monday and then I did vlog like my first day at the UN, like actually in there in person. So that was pretty cool, but like that was on Wednesday and I just never came back to the week of my life vlog. And I honestly don't even really think I ended the UNFPA vlog either. So um, I'm not sure when this vlog is going to come out. I'm not sure if this is going to be the first day or <laughs> another day and now my camera battery is dying. Oh my god. believe I made it to campus so early I this is insane fun fact about this morning I completely thought my meeting was at 8 a.m. but it's actually at 9 a.m. so I ended up having so much time and now I'm on campus at 8 40 a.m. love this for me I had to go to Target because I forgot my headphones at home this morning and I literally just bought the cheapest ones that they have but I fully intend on like returning them tomorrow so we're gonna do that Welcome to a little week in my life. I start my UN internship today. We're just gonna have like an online session and like a group team meeting, so that should be fun. A lot of things happening in my life, but the center is really like holistic wellness. So if you like that, make sure you subscribe. And my arm is starting to hurt, like. <laughs> so I'm gonna go back to the table and like get ready for my, uh, my 9 a.m. meeting. I'm really excited to meet my boss. Well, like, I met her, obviously, when she interviewed me, but I'm excited to just have my first day. All right, I'll see you guys in a bit. Oh, subscribe. Today, this might just be a day of my life. 
So today we actually have a pretty fun day. I obviously have to do schoolwork and I have to do my doula training stuff. I also forgot I'm training to be a doula. So much stuff is going on. But then tonight my friend is having their annual Halloween party. I'll put a picture of my outfit like last year. I just, he has like the best Halloween parties. It's always so much fun. And he's been sending me like how he's decorated his apartment. So I just know tonight's going to be a really fun time. So I figured I'd take you guys along with me. And you know, you always need that balance. Like I've been working so hard this week. I definitely deserve to have a little fun on the weekend. But before we can have fun, I do need to like get my life together. I need to finish doing some laundry. I need to do some doula training stuff. I want to do a midterm exam that I have that was take home and open note and thank God for this professor because she has just made my life so much easier. Let's get this day started. Welcome to my channel and don't forget to subscribe. All right, let's go. So now I am on my way into the yoga studio because I normally don't work out on the weekends but I haven't worked out at all this week literally except for like a 10 minute walk that I did on Monday so this should be really good. It's called like a pop punk yoga sculpt. I, I not really know like if I'm sure what pop punk means but it should be fun. because I don't know I feel like YouTube is always like make hair videos and I don't really make hair videos so this can be a hair portion of the hair video I need to blow out my hair I'm gonna straighten it it is currently like 50% humidity now which isn't bad but also not ideal but hopefully my hair will stay straightened I use the t3 hair straightener or hair blow dryer and I absolutely love it. I really want to make a review video on it. Let's start doing my hair. So as you can see, I put my hair in four sections and I also really like for my hair to kind of air dry a little bit before I blow dry it because I just feel like that's less heat you gotta put in your hair. So 
favorite bullet journal ever. I really like it. I had a bootleg Dyson before and I don't know if it's because it was bootleg or because Dysons just aren't the best quality but I kept breaking it because I kept dropping it. So that was that. I'm going to take this section. My hair feels so soft because I use Olaplex. I'm an Olaplex girly. Oh god, I should not be this close to you guys. But before I blow dry my hair, I need to actually get my heat protectant out. So I like to double up on the heat protectant because I have color treated hair. So I'm gonna use the blow dry cream from Briogeo. I actually need more of this. And then I also like to use the Pattern Beauty spray heat protectant as well. haircut that I got a few years ago so it's much longer in the back than it is in the front which I feel like isn't that unusual for my black girlies in life um but right now because you can see even here it's like this is so long and then this is so short but whatever I'm gonna straighten my hair now I'm using my GHG straightener which I'm absolutely obsessed with it's so good I love it so much I highly recommend this hair straightener and I actually did a full review on it on my channel here so if you want to watch it you can watch it now but yeah we're gonna go in with this and I will see you guys in like after another montage. <laughs> I'm halfway through straightening my hair and this side is so much shinier and just like taking better than the, this side. It's like a little frizzier and drier and I already know why. When I was conditioning my hair, I did this side first and I don't think I put as much conditioner in it as when I started doing this side and I could literally feel the difference in the shower. I was kind of lazy and I was just like whatever about it and now now we're seeing it in my hair being like look it's kind of it's just like a little dull and then this is just so shiny like do you see how shiny this side is and then this side is just like <sighs> i mean the proof is in the pudding and i honestly i'm not really a hair influencer so i'm probably not going to be wearing swimsuits in the shower to show you guys but just trust me like if one side of your hair feels dry while you are conditioning it just put more conditioner because now i'm gonna have to deal with like half beautiful shiny hair and half kind of like dry-ish frizzy hair but hopefully next time i wash my hair i can just do a deep conditioner and hopefully fix it all
bit. I'm just going to finish off with a little bit of this Moroccan oil. Honestly, this is my favorite. I don't get the light kind. I like it extra thick, extra oily, and I literally just rub up in my hands and focus it on the ends of my hair. A little on the top. But yeah, that is it. My hair is done. Let's put on our Beyonce costume. Honestly, we have some time. <laughs> it's actually 555 five, five right now. Um, that means a lot of positive changes coming in your life. Um, but because it's only 6 o'clock, I don't think the party really starts until like 10 or 11. So we're going to eat something for dinner and then try to figure out this Beyonce costume. But definitely have a lot of time. I thought it was going to be like rushing. <laughs> and I guess try to staple the gloves together. I was gonna buy some glue, but I'm trying not to buy a lot of stuff. I'm on a student budget. Kind of how it's like laid out. I think I need to put on the bodysuit first and the leggings and then kind of see about the hand placement just so everything looks great, but I'm actually really super, super excited. <laughs> so she is on. She looks really cute. I'm really excited. You can kind of see like my tights right here so I'm definitely gonna put a glove here and then I kind of want one on like my little my boobies so I'm thinking like this right like that and then maybe around and down all right let's see how I'm gonna <laughs> staple these on I think I need to mark them with like a pen or something <sighs> okay give me a second I need to figure this out I found the stapler I'm excited! <laughs> God, shut up. It actually looks really good. I just need to staple the other fingers and then I guess I'll just cut this glove off a little bit. But wow, it's coming together! Update, one of the staples have fallen out, but <laughs> we can still get it together. Um, I feel really scared using a stapler so close to my crotch, but you know, it's fine. Look. Oh my god. I also kind of don't want to staple it that way because I don't want you to be able to see. So maybe I'll just do this way for the next one. I don't want you to be able to see the staples. Okay, that's better. Oh my god. <laughs> the things we do for the love of Beyonce. <laughs> oh my god, it looks so good. <laughs> ah, I love it. Like that. Here she is. I'm actually not mad at this at all. Like, come on, $30 Halloween costume, push through. I um, have some thigh-high socks that I'm gonna put on. I have other gloves. Let me find those. Let me find those. Okay, I got them. So I have two more pairs of gloves because I originally thought I was gonna do the back too, but I don't feel like doing all of that, but I will wear a black pair of gloves to complete the outfit, obviously. Ooh, ah, I 
love it. <laughs> oh, they look so good. Okay, she is giving sexy Beyonce Ooh, realness. <laughs> okay, and wait, piece of resistance. It gets even better, I know. Wait, they're so fire. Oh my God. The outfit is complete. Like, yes, bitch, yes. Ah, I love it. Okay. Wow, I'm so ready for this party now. Ah, you know love is my weakness. Don't need drugs for some freak shit. I'm just high all the time. I'm out of my mind. I'm tweaking, tweaking, tweaking. Okay, I'm sending this to Beyonce. I need um my contract ASAP. <laughs> okay, let me do my makeup. And then I told my friend I'd pick up some cups for the party. I actually already have cups. So I'm gonna bring that and then I should probably like bring some type of alcohol so yay i'm really excited the party starts at 9 30 which honestly means the party starts at 10 30 knowing my friend and it's 9 08 so we're making a really great timing i'm gonna do my makeup it'll probably take me like an hour but the costume is done and i am feeling it i'm gonna take everything off because i was getting hot but let's do our makeup really quick I still need to make like a um like an everyday makeup video because I swear I really don't need to do my makeup that much. But maybe I'll do a fun little eyeshadow because we are such a fierce. And then I also like to do some loose powder before I even start. Just to like really pack it all in there, you know? Maybe I put a little too much powder. It's a possibility. I literally look like a ghost. Oh my god. Elise and Casper, your friendly ghost bitches. Wow, this vlog. It's only a day, so I'm trying to talk to you guys, give you some content, because who doesn't like a long vlog, you know? Nobody wants this concealer is so old. This concealer is so old. I bought this one during the last Sephora sale. And it's already the Sephora seal again. So let me just use my new one. This is my favorite foundation ever and Bite went out of business and I didn't get another one. So I'm just suffering. Look at that. Tell me that is not my skin. Tell me. Please try. Please. Okay, I wanna clamp my eyebrows a little bit. And then I just clean it up. My eyebrows honestly don't even grow that long, so like, it's never really much to clean up. <laughs> but I feel like I cut this side too short, but whatever. For my brows, I'm just using this like nude stick eyebrow pencil that I absolutely love, highly recommend. So yeah, that's it. And I wish this side looked a little wolfy. I think I like cut a little too much off of this side, but. Oh, go back. Shade Mocha Mommy for my bronzer. I am going to put some of the bronzer eyeshadow place for continuity because soft glam, you know? Soft, so. Okay, so I'm going to go with this like pinkish reddish color because I feel like Beyonce definitely had like a pinky red vibe going. Yup, and I am already loving it. Wow. Wow, I am obsessed. Oh, this is so good. Speaking of, I missed my upload day on Wednesday and I need to upload for you guys. Great, and then I wanna lighten this up a little bit, not too much. That's the theme of my makeup. Not too much, as I do so much. <gasps> Bitch. Oh my God. Oh my God. Smucker, smucker. What do you think? I'm obsessed. Okay, 
and I'm also sweating. I'm trying not to sweat because my hair is going to get big. I just need to do a little under my eye. Probably just this dark one. And I honestly don't wear like black eyeliner ever. I just like doing like a natural, super unnatural eyeliner. <laughs> oh my god, I want to put a little, let's do a little shimmer in the middle. Oh, yes, bitch. Oh my god, I forgot which one I, I picked that quick. Um, oh my god, oh my god, which one was it? I think it was this one. No, it wasn't. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. That's embarrassing. So I accidentally put a different color here than here, and you know, that's life. <laughs> okay. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Okay, I feel like a little sexy fairy. So, the last thing I do is my super unnatural eyeliner. <laughs> and I just line my waterline because I just like it to look nice and bright. Because, I don't know, I just think it looks better. I'm just obsessed. I've been doing this for a very long time. Okay, mascara. I literally thought I was done with my makeup and I didn't do any blush or highlight. So, let's smile. <laughs> Do the highlight. I also still need to do my lips too. I haven't done those. I'll probably just do like a little nude, nothing crazy. Okay, my loves. I think this is where I love you and leave ya. Hold on, let me adjust you a little bit. I'm gonna wear this huge ass jacket. I really wasn't going to because as I said earlier in the video, it was 80 degrees in New York today. It is 70 degrees right now, so I really don't need this jacket, but I feel like it gives cozy vibes. I'm gonna carry my little Louis Vuitton purse, my, wall my wallet, my cell phone, obviously. I don't really think I need anything else. I told my friend I'm bringing cups, but I realized the cups that I have I actually wanna save for my party next weekend, but I do have these, so I'm gonna bring them and Hopefully find something to drink, like some White Claws or something around the corner. I do think I have a liquor store around the corner. And yeah, then I'm off to his party. I will definitely insert some clips here, but I'm... Saturday with me together I just love these glasses and I love you guys make sure you subscribe I'm currently at 816 subscribers so if you could be 817 I love ya and I will see you guys in my next upload